Bye, hello everyone, it's Tani here. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we are back with the next part of our BitLife Let's Play series where we kind of just live a random life and see what happens. Before we get into it though, I want to give today's post notification shout out to Bobby the Best. Thank you for turning on my notifications. If you guys ever want to shout out one of my videos, all you have to do is subscribe, turn on post notifications, and comment them down below, and you can be next. With that being said, let's get into it. So, as you guys know, for our Let's Play series, we always do a random life, and I go into it with no expectations expectations at all and we kind of just figure out and see what happens we're just gonna randomize our life 10 times and pick whoever it is one two three four five six seven eight nine ten okay so we are Enrico Pomodoro we are male we're from Florence Italy our special talent is music this is our appearance and these are our attributes so we don't have good discipline <laughs> um, so I guess we'll probably get into trouble um, we have high fertility high happiness good karma not good looks not good smarts and not good willpower literally zero willpower so <laughs> So maybe we'll like get involved with all the like bad things for us like peer pressure and stuff And maybe we can do something with music considering a special talent is music I am a male who came into the world through artificial insemination in Florence, Italy My mother decided to have me after winning a free sperm sample at the grand opening of a local fertility clinic My birthday is September 15th and I'm a Virgo. Amazing. Oh my mom's a writer. Oh, and she has pink hair Oh, and she got money. Okay. Well, hopefully Hopefully uh, I don't get any more siblings, so it can be mine as always, but let's let's see what happens Oh, I thought our looks and smarts were low. We were just born and they're high apparently now So I've been banging pots and pans together on the kitchen floor lately and it's music to my ears I guess I really am having a special talent as music definitely gonna look into that a little boy named Paolo wants to be your friend Oh, I press surprise me Oops. <laughs> I guess we're friends with Paolo and Carlo. Oh my gosh, there should be an option in the music thing where you can start a band with people you know. Like imagine me, Paolo, Carlo, and Enrico all joining a band, all making like a young band together. Like that would be insane. And my mom is constipation, it's good to know. <laughs> so I'm friends with Paolo, Carlo, Leonardo, and I'm Enrico. Our names all end with O. <laughs> What are the odds of that? Well, we're in a private primary school. That's bougie. Should I go for an instrument or singing? I'm kind of digging the drums and maybe we can be a drummer for a band because I feel like being in a band is a little more spicy. <laughs> is there electric guitar? I can't remember. There's bass guitar. Okay, we'll go for drums. Okay, my mom agreed. Okay, let's get these drum lessons. Perfect. Ooh, cherry drums she gifted me. Thank you. Let's play with them. I damaged them? No way. That's not fair. Okay. Does that bring my talent up? I guess not. Okay. So drum lessons. Oh, probably increasing my drum lessons makes me like not break them every time I use them. So definitely got to stick with that. My mom is iconic. She wants to buy me a pet rabbit named Jeffrey. Yes. Hi, Jeffrey. You look like Coco, except Coco has two color coat. Okay. Let's give him a treat. Give him some water crush. Spend some time with him. Hi, Jeffrey. Heart to heart about whether or not pineapple blogs on pizza listen this is my stance on this okay i want to hear your guys's opinion too so i'll never go out of my way to order pineapple on pizza but if it is there at a party i will happily take a slice and eat it and enjoy it but i won't go out of my way to order it if that makes sense this year's signups for the school band are closing soon and there's still a few more spots okay um, I don't know what type of instrument drums are, so I'm just gonna say I'm gonna do a brass instrument. I played the French horn. Interesting. It, that That is definitely not the drums, um, but I'll take it. Speaking of drums, we gotta practice. We gotta get that bar full. We're gonna be a successful drummer. That is the goal. I really wanna join a band, and I wish I could join a band with my friends. But I'm just hoping they don't unfriend me, because I'm waiting till the spend time with all button pops up. <laughs> it's time to go to your first school dance, and you are attracted to a girl in your class named Julia. Ask Julia to go with me. The girl I asked to the dance is not who I'm gonna kiss. This girl is Armenia. Kiss her. Ooh, don't tell Julia. Okay, so I spend time with everyone, but Carlo hates me. So let's compliment him. Oh, Carlo didn't even want to go to a Post Malone concert with me. That's how you know he's like over me. Let's watch YouTube. 
Bijou Mike. We did a good job. He should be my friend again now. Okay, yeah, spend time with everyone and he agreed. So let's join some activities. What should we join? Orchestra maybe? Yeah, let's go orchestra. Even though drums aren't in the orchestra, if I remember correctly, but we'll do it anyways. And we finally got the drum bar. Oh, my bunny died. Okay, well, at least it was because of old age. So that means he lived a good life. RIP Jeffrey, mourn his death. The fact that my mom can literally afford all this private school is insane. I have chest pain. Do I have heart disease at 14? Pneumonia. Did I get it from Jeffrey? Like, orchestra's gone, so I guess we'll go for a concert band. There we go. Ooh, you know what I want to do? I want to go through my class. Armenia, she's who I had my first kiss with. Is Julia still there? <gasps> I guess Julia moved. Oh, wait, no, is this her? So which one should I ask out, Julia or Armenia? Oh, not Armenia. She has the last name as me. What if they're cousins? <laughs> oh, oh, no. Uh, uh, Julia it is. Nah, ask out Julia. She has the same last name as me. That's messed up. Can we get eloped? We're not old enough. I need to wipe my memories. Driver's test, we pass. Ask for more expensive car. Alexis, look at my mom go. Sell it. 77,000 euros. Also, sometimes in the video, I might slip up and say dollars, but I do know it's euros, guys. No one wants it. I lowballed, whatever. I took 54k for it. Don't sue me. Okay, we've graduated. We're taking time off. My friend Leonardo has made me his enemy. What did I even do to you? Play a prank on him. I sent him a glitter bomb that blew up in his face. Called me a loner. I have a girlfriend, so I'm not a loner. Literally by definition. Fancy resort. Okay, I need to buy this girl a ring. <laughs> <laughs> Good for her for holding her ground though. Okay, let's buy her a diamond ring for 18k. Okay, a mountain. Oh, she accepted. We're gonna be young lovers, okay? 19 years old. Listen, everyone says we're too young, but we're gonna prove them wrong. Banquet hall in Virginia. We don't need a prenup. Okay, you know what time it is. It is time to start our band career. Okay, I told Julia the entire time. I was like, listen, honey, you don't gotta worry about anything. You see these hands? They drum. <laughs> and they drum well. So I got you, girl. You're gonna be on tour with me. Let's go for a band. I'm gonna be a drummer. Worship! <sighs> not looking for that, honestly. Paulo has unfriended me. Well, that's the normal thing to do, not to swear me as his enemy. So I don't know what happened with Leonardo. Ooh, I found a pop one, and their last year's earnings is a million euros and high popularity audition. No! <laughs> I'm so hurt. That was so mean. Okay, I found a rock one. Yes, I got it. <laughs> I wanted pop for like the ability to be able to get like diamond records, right? But I'll go with rock. That's just as good. If, if anything, that's even better for a drummer. So there are six members currently. So I think I'm going to be the seventh member. So the earnings are going to be divided by seven, which kind of sucks. But they have good popularity. Like, they made a good amount of earnings. So I will join. I'm a famous rock star. Oh my gosh. And now my wife is going to be like my rock star girl beside me at all times. Her hairstyle is like perfect for that as well. I should change my hairstyle. What should I change it to? Salon and spa. Let's let's see. What's like rock? What's giving rock? Oh yeah. And we're gonna dye it like red. But yeah, we'll go with that. Okay, let's see. I'm a professional drummer. Oh, our band is called Deep Blue. So let's see our members. So we have Rika Pluto, Gabriella Bruno, Domenico Gambino, Cosimo Apizi, Neil Ruby, and Angelo Zombie. Should I like give myself a stage name? Maybe we can do like a Rihanna thing where it's just our first name. We don't have the best relationship with everybody, but hopefully as we go on, we will. But I'm just gonna change my name to just Enrico. We'll make it a stage name. First name kind of thing. Just like Zendaya. Okay, let's practice on our skills. Go. And one thing I wanted to check as well. Okay, so the respect is decent. So let's just see. Let's, I'm not gonna try and change the band's name because they're gonna hate me forever. So we're working on a single Hotbox Hero. I think we're gonna go for classic rock and cover art, whatever, an exploding Zeppelin shirt. Sure. They agreed to make it, okay. You've been invited to appear on the critically acclaimed food talk show, The Chomp, to promote your upcoming single, Hotbox Hero. What's the spirit of the album? Something saucy. Oh. <laughs> Disappointment. Well, hopefully I don't get kicked out of the band for that. <laughs> oh, should I mess with my enemy? Let's start a rumor about Leonardo. Was adopted. He attacked me. Time to sue. I'm suing my enemy. <laughs> Nothing you can do about it. $100,000. No! I lost! The audacity! No way! No way! Whatever. 
Let's do a concert. In Cagliari, concert hall, 5,000 people, good. Another one in Cagliari. Okay, let's age. During the show, <laughs> a fan in the front row spits on you. I was gonna say hook up with her cause like enemy to lover, but not trying to be unfaithful. So ignore. Okay, we're gonna go for an album now. Studio album. Oh wait, actually, should we do a different type of album? Oh, single album, no. Studio album, you're done. <laughs> you're next. 11 tracks, let's do a smash guitar. Okay, let's spend some time together. That's a lead off track, right? They agreed to make it good. You decide that you need to drum up, get it, I'm a drummer. Some publicity for your upcoming album, you're next. Halika soundbite. Okay, it was moderate success. Halisa wasn't a disappointment. That, that, that hurt. Like this? <laughs> This made me sad. No, my hair changed. Oh, what happened to my red mohawk? I'm sad. Should we do a world tour? <laughs> okay, a 13 week. Let's do it. <laughs> Total attendance was 730,000 people. Gross revenue, 59 million. Net earnings, 11. And my proceeds, <laughs> because there's six other members, 1 million. Our relationship with everyone in the band is good. Usually in bands, the singers are like the leaders, but how do I become the leader? And like, I want to like kick everyone out of the band at a certain point just to establish my dominance. You know what I mean? So should I try and kick out the singer? I successfully did it. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm proud of myself. <laughs> Isn't that what happens? I don't know. We'll see what happens when we age. Your band is looking for opportunities to gain local popularity and decides to do a flash concert this weekend in Florence. Where we should do it? In front of a strip club, honey. Ooh, we have a new singer. Eh, I'm gonna try and kick out Neil. <laughs> Gosh, it's why is it working? The fact that I literally kicked out both lead singers of the band and everyone else just let me. <laughs> what? Who does that? Me, apparently. Enrico. Okay, moderate success. Not bad. Oh, this time it's an 18-week tour. Let's do it. Huh. We had even more attendees. Last time we had, like, what was it? 700,000, but this time it's 1.1 million. Okay, I need to, like, take my wife on a date. We're gonna take her to the movies. Oh, she didn't like it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, at least she's like coming with me to travel on tour, you know, practice on our skills, do another world tour. I just want to be a rock star mom. Oh, this is our biggest gig yet. Athens, Greece, music festival, 600,000 people, period. The fact that Carlo, we've had a horrible relationship all these years, but he understands. He understands that I'm a busy rock star. Like he hasn't made me his enemy like Leonardo and he hasn't left me like the other guy. I can't even remember his name. So let's compliment Carlo and we'll get him a nice gift playstation 4 because he has been there with me since the beginning i almost pressed hook up that would be cheating <laughs> and i'm gonna take my beautiful wife julia who was literally my first dance on a nice little vacation okay we're gonna go on a cruise a sweet a mediterranean cruise and bring julia with me and she loved it oh you know what i should buy <gasps> i should buy a boat or a private jet and be able to take her out anywhere she wants is there no private jet hold on oh there is <laughs> oh i don't have enough i need 16 million okay listen julia I'm gonna grind for you. We're gonna get that jet and I'm gonna be able to fly you out anywhere you want to go. <gasps> okay, our one-year-old single, It's All Good Now, just went gold. It is our first gold record, but I've been taking some time. I have 12 million euros because I'm trying to get enough money to be able to fly out my wife everywhere on a private jet. So <laughs> I think after this year, we'll be able to. So I'm just kind of doing all the concerts we can every single year, right? And a world tour, because every time we do a tour, we make over like, like two mil this year we made three that is our most yet and then now we're on to our next album so classic rock let's do a skull with crossbones welcome to the red parade commercial success it didn't go gold but i think it will soon because we basically sold 400,000 copies so okay let's see if i can get a jet i know there was one that was 16 million <gasps> there's one that's nine okay okay we can do it Tell the pilot's license okay come on we're almost there okay take the test we passed yes okay time to buy our jet time to buy our jet pay with cash period my wife is arguing honey i bought it for you <laughs> no she's afraid i'm gonna fly off to some exotic location and have an affair no literally i bought it for you i bought it for you defend the purchase it is for you it's not for anyone else honey take it for a flight oh What's going on? While flying across open skies at top speed and you're in Brayer Praetor 500 airplane, you suddenly encounter an unavoidable mess of black storm clouds so violent your plane 
bank sharply out of control. I just spent 9 million euros on this and it is crashing. I know if I choose anything else but jump out, I'm going to die. But if I jump out, I lose the plane. I don't want to lose this jet. I don't want to lose this jet. What happens if I try to land as calmly as possible? Oh, I landed safely. Listen, guys, sometimes in life, you got to take a risk. <laughs> Not in that situation, but we can because it's bit like so. Um, yeah, take it for a flight. Oh no, oh no. Okay, well, we're landing it, but how do I actually take it on vacation? Go on a vacation and then not have to pay for it? Then a vacation. Oh, private. Okay, there we go. Paris, France. Bring Julia with me. Do it. See, Julia, I got it for you. I didn't get it for anyone else but you. Make love to celebrate. Oh, no wish you were there what gold period i literally am gonna spoil my wife so much i got her a private jet i'm gonna get us a cruise ship i'm gonna get her a big old house fancy car i'm gonna upgrade her eighteen thousand dollar ring to like a million dollar ring when i can or euro so let's try and get her a nice house a futuristic home just for my girl buy it anyway it's for you girl julia <laughs> Julia, relax. It's for you. Julia, row a house party. 13 guests came to our multifunctional futuristic home. All the police, police showed up because our neighbors called the cops. Apologize. <laughs> the police identified supplying alcohol to minors. I swear, if I get kicked out of my band, cooperate. Which local law firm? Agnesian Associates. Not guilty. You are joking. You are joking. I have been convicted of supplying alcohol to minors and sentenced to one year in prison. I have been fired by Deep Blue. Why does everything in all my BitLife videos lead to crime eventually? I don't get it. Because now I have the urge of revenge. <laughs> A range of conjugal. <gasps> no. Should I escape? It's literally one year. But I want to make it a little spicy. <laughs> Start a riot. <laughs> No, I want, no, listen, bribe the guards. <gasps> they approached me and screamed at me. Okay, I'm escaping. I literally don't care. No! My prison. No, the mini games have failed me. Usually it always lets me when you don't have to do the mini game. It's just so upsetting. Oh, I'm just gonna cry. Cry and then join a gang. No, <laughs> this is going so wrong. Well, in prison yard, you bump into a fellow prisoner named Shirley Marino, who's busted for aggravated twerking. Compliment him. That he's a perfect ten. He stormed me. Do you not like compliments? No. <laughs> what is happening? I had one year and now I'm in for like five. I'm finally released from prison. I'm so sad. I'm in debt. <laughs> I think I need to sell my private jet. Um, somebody please buy it. I really need to apologize to my wife. I should not have tried escaping. Crime was not my special talent. <laughs> Nobody wants it. I'm so sorry, wifey. I gotta sell the house too. I gotta sell these drums. My, my my wife just told me that because you haven't been meeting her sexual needs, she went out and found someone else. She cheated on me. Julia, why? Consider it a divorce. The judge has ordered your assets to be divided equally. You will end up with 10 million euros in assets after 21 years of marriage. That hurt. I lost my band. Deep blue. I lost my childhood sweetheart. And most importantly, I've lost myself. <laughs> and I'm liquidating all my money. I don't trust anyone. My ex-wife just sent me a picture of her fresh bikini waxing. File a restraining order. <laughs> Take that. Karma. Well, that is called revenge for cheating. Watch her have cheated on me with literally Leonardo. <laughs> So I thought I'd take a risk and move a little something something, but I got arrested. Now at least I can join again. <laughs> um, cash money wreckers, rejected. Ex angels, rejected, and they, they killed me, basically. Bit is in mafia. Blue ball bulls. <laughs> they killed me, okay. Nobody likes me. <laughs> so this life was a little scandalous, apparently. <laughs> Enrico Pomodoro died after being beaten lifeless by the Blue Ball Bulls prison gang. A gifted man, 
Enrico's years of dedication paid off when he became a drummer in the band Deep Blue. Friends recall his family's pride when he joined his school's orchestra. Yeah, that really took a turn for the worse. I really don't know what happened. Everything went downhill after I hosted a party at the house and somehow was arrested. So yeah, that was our little episode of our Bit Life Let's Play. And if you guys want to see more, just let me know. But with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one.